you don't have anything nice to say, you just don't say it. We would like to acknowledge that we are here today on the traditional territory of the Mississaugas of the Credit First Nation. with the beautiful voices what book you like and it doesn't matter how you sound it's only a matter matter is that how beautiful you are how much people love you bye People have different skin colours, hair colours, eye colours and more in the exact same way. There are different ways our brains can be wired. About 8% of people are boring, or you could say normal people. And about 20% have brains that are wired differently, which includes ADHD, dyslexia and of course autism. Each brain type has its own unique positives and negatives, but the problem is people can't see that our brains are wired differently, so autistic people are often misunderstood. We don't want to fix autism. We want to fix Fortnite because it's dead. We want people to embrace 
our strengths and support us with our difficulties so we can become the best we can be. People often don't take time to understand how our brains work, which can make life more difficult than it should be. Those are bacteria and germs, and they make up a sticky goo called plaque. Plaque can build up on your teeth. They're so tiny. They look little, but they can cause big problems. Like what? They can cause bad breath and even worse, cavities. What are cavities? The outside of your tooth is like a shield, keeping the inside of your tooth safe. If you get a cavity, it can go through that shield into the inside of your tooth where your nerves live. And that can hurt. Good morning, EBS. I hope everyone is having a terrific start to their Tuesday morning. Speaking of terrific, I wanted to spend some time this morning to acknowledge some of our terrific students. Now, we know everybody at EBS is absolutely incredible. We know how hard you all work and all the innovation that goes into your projects and to your assignments. But there are some students this morning that I wanted to take a moment and give a shout out to because they are continuing to exemplify everything that EBS is all about. So I would love for our incredible teachers to sound off in the emojis and show some appreciation for the following EBS students. with Deshaun in Miss Brown's great life class, who did an amazing job co-hosting our Read Aloud yesterday. So please give a round of applause to Deshaun. I want to give a shout out to Simeon in Mr. Metzler's great eight class. Simeon is incredible at being an advocate for himself when he needs help with something. And this is such an important skill, especially as our grade sevens and our grade eights go on to high school, being able to advocate for yourself when you don't understand something. So huge shout out to Simeon and Mr. Metzler's class. I also want to give a shout out to Jaden R and Isaiah M from Miss Roy's grade three class. Simeon and, sorry, Jaden and Isaiah do an excellent job at engaging in small groups. And at EBS, we know we are all about small groups 
and they spend their time in their small groups so effectively learning together. I am going to continue with Adam in Mrs. Cooper's grading class. So something about Adam. Adam always tries his best and he's always smiling, which brings such a positive attitude to the entire class. I'm going to continue with some of our amazing grade fives now. Mana and Aisha in Miss Sawani's grade five class. So they have been using AI in their arts to write songs. And I can't wait to see how these turn out. And I would love to showcase them on the morning announcements for our entire community. I have one more to do. I'm almost done. I want to give a shout out to Gershon and Shazil and Miss McEachern's great eight class. They are amazing at editing videos and showing their class how to work creatively and cooperatively together. So I want to give a final shout out to every single one of you and all the amazing contributions that you bring to UBS each and every single day. Before we go this morning, I also want to remind our grade six, seven, and eight students, if you are interested in our AI virtual camps, that are happening at EBS this summer, please check with your teacher. Your teachers have the links that you can sign up. There are four different class offerings, all involving AI. So if you wanna get ahead of the game for next year, make sure you sign up for those pants. EBS, I hope you have a terrific Tuesday and we will see you again tomorrow morning. Have a great day, everyone. Yo!